Without good marketing, it's very difficult to be successful. And oftentimes, it's the marketing that determines whether or not a product and a company is going to succeed. Where I see the future going, and it's already happening, is the way to differentiate with consumers is to try to connect with them on an emotional level. That you form some kind of bond with the customer, uh, and that makes them very loyal and committed to the brand. And what we hope to do in our education is educate the leaders of tomorrow to challenge them and to get them to think about problems and a way of thinking and solving problems. And we bring in top-level executives into the classroom from companies like Dell, Frito Lay, Walmart, General Electric. Uh, one time, uh, one of the top-level marketing executives from Dell came into our class, and he said, "I'm meeting with Michael, Michael Dell, at five o'clock. I've got a problem. Help me solve it." So we had a very lively and active discussion. And he told me afterwards he got a lot of good ideas, and he took those ideas directly to a meeting with Michael Dell later that day. This is a living case. Rather than reading about it on a piece of paper, they get to discuss and talk with the actual decision maker, and so the students get to learn um, in real time. And we get a two-way interchange of the company representatives learn a lot, and our students learn a lot from this dialogue. And hopefully, when they go out into their organizations, that will lead to better marketing activities. It's not just about profit; it's also about how can we create environments and products that are better for consumers and fulfill their needs. So companies are. Becoming more and more sensitive to customer needs because that's what it's all about. We want to provide better value to consumers.